Isabella Blow was very famous for nurturing young talent and discovering fashion designers at graduate level. She discovered Alexander McQueen, which is probably her most famous discovery, along with Philip Tracy, Julia MacDonald and Hussein Shalyan, to name just a few. So in 1992, um, Isabella turned up late to the MA Central St Martins uh, show and because she was late uh, she couldn't find a seat so she sat on the floor and one of the designers showing that day was Alexander McQueen. It was love at first sight, she said his clothes moved like hell. Uh, he had previously been um, working as an apprentice on Savile Row and his tailoring was, was really developed which Isabella loved and adored and, and, and instantly saw um, his, his beauty and his potential. So she called Central St Martins and, and asked to speak with Alexander McQueen, to which they said, well, you know, he's not here. At, at which point he was Lee McQueen, uh, Lee Alexander McQueen. And uh, so she somehow got hold of his mother's telephone number. And so after many conversations with his mother, Mrs McQueen said, Lee, there's this woman who will not stop calling for you. And he finally called her back and said, well, you know, what, you know, what do you want? Um, and she said, well, I want, to, I want to buy your whole MA collection because I think it's great. And he said, uh, a price, some say 200, some say 2,000. But for whatever the price was, Isabella said, well, that's quite expensive. And he said, but I made it. And um, that just really summed up their relationship, I think. And it, it, much like Philip Tracy, uh, it completed her look. Uh, Manolo Blahnik's shoes on her feet, um, a garment of Alexander McQueen, and a hat by Philip Tracy on her, her, the crown of her head.